How do I receive compassion for others? My friend, compassion is part of the very character of God demonstrated through Jesus Christ. I'm remembering the scripture when it says Jesus saw the multitudes and he was moved with compassion for them, for they were like sheep who did not have a shepherd. Now, when you hear this, it's an insight to the very heart of God in the demonstration of the life of Jesus Christ. So compassion is God's attitude toward others. It's true, today, God's attitude is to be expressed through his people. Born again, spirit-filled people should not be people of condemnation. They should not be people of judgment. They should not be people of anger. They should be people of compassion. How can we have compassion? We have compassion because we learn to see people through the eyes of God. God loves people. Even people who have done horrible things, he still loves them. He has not given up on them. And for us to be the influences that we're to be in the world, for us to be the carriers of the life of Jesus Christ to people who are hurting, we have to care about them. We have to have that same compassion. So in thinking, how do I receive it? Number one, we need to study the life of Jesus. We need to see the heart of God throughout all the scripture. We need to see how he cares and how he intervenes, how he rescues those who don't even deserve it. We need to see how he heals those. Sometimes they've not even asked. We see him stepping in to meet needs, to embracing the outcast, to, to accepting the sinner, to forgiving sins, to, to demonstrate his Compassion. Compassion isn't just a feeling. It is something we put into action. So, my friend, when you consider how to have this compassion, first we know Jesus. Then we know we're to be his example. We're to be his reflection. We're to be his, his carrier of his life in our communities. How do we do that? We can't do that by ourselves. None of us can do that. But through the power of the Holy Spirit, we can be a compassionate force in the earth. I'm challenging you today. Apply the compassion of Jesus in your circumstance, in your family, people you work with, people who sometimes are not nice to you, those who have hurt you. Just have compassion. Ask the Lord to show you their hearts. Why do they behave the way they do? Have compassion on them, for if they only knew Jesus the way you do, they would not behave the way they do. I thank you for asking this question because that means you will become a carrier of compassion in your community. Let it be so by the power of God's Spirit. Amen.